Um, all right. Good evening. My name is Geetika. Can you please tell me your full name? My full name is Harmeet Garman. Uh, just call me Harmeet. Okay. And Harmeet, where are you from? Um, I come from Mamsa. Uh, I have born and raised here. Uh, so, you know, I am living here since my whole life. Uh, and I am a foodie as well. So, particularly Mamsa has a variety of cuisines. And we can try as many we want to. Okay. Um, Harneet, I'm just going to ask you a few uh, general questions now. Okay. Yes. So, um, yeah. all right. Um, do you have a pet? Uh, could you repeat, ma'am? Sure. Do you have a pet? Oh, yes. Uh, I have a pet. Uh, uh, I have a golden retriever. She is female and her name is Bella. She is so mischievous dog and I love her so much. Okay. Um, what type of animals do you think make the best pets? Um, even though in my country, most of the people prefer cats uh, as a good pet, uh, but I am more inclined towards dog uh, because dogs are so much innocent uh, than cats uh, and they are so loyal and loving animals. All right. Uh, why do people have pets? Well, in today's era, everyone is so depressed and stressed. Uh, so, uh, like after your whole hectic schedule, if you play with your pets, uh, that will boost your mood and uh, that make you happy. Uh, and even though many studies also claim that playing with your pets reduce your heart diseases by 50%. Okay. All right. Are there any types of animals that you think should not be kept as a pet? Uh, uh, well, yes. Uh, some sort of wild animals shouldn't keep as a pet. Uh, just in my neighbor, um, my neighbor keep a small tiger as a pet, baby tiger as a pet. Uh, and I don't think that's necessary. Uh, because it is dangerous for the society and other community members. Okay, all right. Okay, good. Um, I'm going to give you um, some time to think about a topic. I'll uh, reveal the topic on the screen. I'll share my screen. And I'll give you about a minute to think about the topic. Okay? okay. And I'd like you to talk yeah. about it for one to two minutes. Okay. You have a pen and paper? Uh, yes, I have. Excellent. Can you see the screen? Uh, yeah. All right. So I'd like you to describe a wild animal that lives in your country. And you should say what animal it is, where it lives, um, how people feel about this animal, and explain any other things um, around this topic. So you've got a minute to think about it. Right, could you start now? Uh, yes, ma'am. Uh, well, there are certain number of wild animals in my country. Uh, but uh, one animal that is so famous is tiger. Uh, in my country, most of the tigers live in zoos, forests, or wildlife sanctuaries. Uh, because most of the people are fear stricken by this animal uh, as it is very dangerous. Uh, just 
last week uh, news is roaming around all my country is that a tiger e ate a tiger ate a five year old child uh, near delhi uh, and that's very devastating news and one more thing is that uh, tigers are main part of our ecosystem uh, as to maintain ecosystem and food chain that, that is running throughout the world uh, is very necessary uh, to keep the world running better and if tigers are extincted uh, then the whole world will collapse soon uh, as the food chain is food chain will be destroyed uh, and uh, last month i got a chance to work with the researcher company uh, and in that uh, we uh, researched about tigers about their habitat or how is their eating process uh, and that seemed very fascinating to me uh, uh, and after that i got a lot of knowledge about these wild animals uh, that they are not very dangerous uh, but they need All right to you can stop now okay ma'am okay i'm just going to ask you a few more questions um, that would revolve around part 2 So, what is the purpose of having zoos, according to you? Um, well, zoos are a habitat for those animals uh, that nowadays can't survive in forests because in forests there uh, there is not. I mean, sorry. Carry on. It's okay. Our uh, forests are so much destroyed nowadays, and in India there are very few. Uh, so zoos will be a good habitat for ones uh, that are on the verge of extinction all right um how do you think zoos could be improved uh yeah certainly because uh, in my country uh, condition of zoos are so bad uh, because the caretakers there and the infrastructure or the food that is provided to animals is so bad uh, and there should be and there should be taken a immediate concern uh, for improvement of zoos okay <clears throat> what is your opinion on poaching uh, on poaching poaching animals i can't listen properly ma'am uh, what's your opinion about poaching animals p o a c h i n g getting animals from somewhere else p o a c h i n g poaching actually Over. i don't okay um you can answer this next question do you think oh, yes. monkey should be spent oh, sorry money should be <laughs> spent on protecting wild animals yeah government should uh, spend more money on protecting wild animals as well as domestic animals uh, because uh, animals is a main part of our ecosystem uh, to run the world properly or to maintain the food chain animals are so important uh, and money should be spent on them so yes all right thank you this is the end of your practice test Hello, my name is Geetika. Can you please tell me your full name? My full name is Abhi uh, Harman Jot Singh Mon. Right, and what can I call you? You can address me from my first name, Abhi. Okay. All right, Abhi. So, um, tell me something about your hometown. I'm sorry, ma'am. Can you tell me something about your hometown? Well, I am from Mansa, a small city. it the full amenities available uh, there are many uh, icsc and cbsc school boards are available and uh, many beautiful parks are available there okay all right so i'm going to ask you a few general questions now um do you like shoes sorry ma'am do you like shoes shoes one shoes shoes Yeah. 
Where do I like to choose? Because uh, shoes. Shoes, ma'am. Yes. Okay. Bar bun roda pehle se sohi jaise. Yes, well, I like many types of shoes. Uh -huh. uh, I usually found uh, uh, many shoes, but recently I have found a new pair of shoes of uh, Nike Jordans. These are very beautiful and white in color. They are very comfortable. Well, shoes uh, helps us to maintain our beauty. As uh, when we met every someone, they first judge with our shoes. All right. How often do you buy shoes? Well, it depends on time, and uh, I bought shoes whenever I was free, uh, or uh, I bought twice a month. All right. Um, do you prefer comfortable or good-looking shoes? Well, according to me, comfortable shoes are uh, more likely to me because uh, comfortable. Because to be comfortable, we can go to work very easily and comfortably. As good-looking shoes are just for good looks, they don't even help us in uh, walking, jogging, and doing our daily chores. Okay. Um, have you ever bought shoes online? Well, I bought many things online. Uh, this, I bought shoes, many types of shoes from online websites like Amazon and uh, Nike. And uh, recently, I have bought a new pair of Jordan shoes from Moonlight, which is very convenient and less uh, and less expensive. Right. So, do you think it's uh, better to buy shoes online or in a store? Well, according to me, it is better to buy shoes online because it is very convenient, and uh, uh, there are many varieties of shoes online instead of uh, in stores. They are very cheap and comfortable. Okay. All right, Abhay, um, I'll give you a topic now and I'd like you to think about it for, for about a minute. And I'd like you to speak on the topic for one to two minutes. Okay? Sure, ma'am. Give me just a few seconds and I'll um, share my screen with you. Can you see my screen clearly? Yes, ma'am. Okay, so this is your topic. I'd like you to talk about this um, topic. Describe a shirt or a dress you wore for a special occasion. Uh, you should say what it is like, when and where you bought it, what special occasion you wore it for, and explain how it made you feel wearing it. So you've got a minute to think about um, your points. All right, could you please start speaking now? Yes, ma'am. Let me start. Yes, please. Yes. Well, I like to purchase many types of things from online and many offline boards. I like to go on many types of occasions as it is very good and uh, very hard, very hard warming for me. But today I would like to share some light on a special occasion. When I bought new clothes, 
uh, it was my brother's marriage which held in uh, january but uh, i have started preparing for my clothes in mid november i have bought a blue color check shirt from elante mall chandigarh it is very comfortable and feeling very nice and good fit for me as uh, it is uh, it has it is blue in color with a checked shirt as it, uh, the company it is from uh, nike company they give us uh, in uh, to match with it they give us a bow tie with it with the coat and it looks very good and uh, it perfectly fits with me i feel very happy because it was my first time to wear a to wear a coat uh, and uh, to wear a bow tie i was firstly i was feeling very un uncomfortable but when i used to it i feel very comfortable about it and everyone in my everyone in my brother's marriage enough uh, even my relatives uh, asked that where you have bought it and uh, it is like good looking shirt so i feel very happy and inspiring that day because it was my first time to buy anything very expensive and uh, it was my first marriage uh, in my home in, of my brother which is very good and very big marriage so i feel very happy that i used to buy that clothes and uh, all right you can stop it, now but now you can stop now thank you Okay. okay, I'm going to ask you a few more questions. So, um, what do you think the clothes we wear say about us? Um, please, can you repeat? Sure. Uh, what do you think the clothes we wear say about us? Well, I think that the clothes we wear say about a lot of from us. because uh, as uh, we choose a different variety of colors as we as we wear white color it tells that uh, it tells that how no sorry may i repeat me sure sure that clothes tells a, a lot of about us as we wear different types of clothes it tells our uh, it tells our skills that how we wear clothes and uh, how we match our clothes with other uh, pants and jeans okay do you think um, that brand name is uh, important for clothes or the same well, i think that brand well i think that the brand name is not uh, useful because uh, it tell uh, it because the uh, the comfortable and uh, the price which we are given in the local shops is not is a competitive at a level but the expensive things are just made of the brand logos they are not specifically chosen uh, they are not different from uh, local shop clothes but uh, due to brand logo they are more expensive and people used to buy it to show off their uh, money and uh, to tell people that we are rich Okay. How do you think fashion will change in the future? Well, I think fashion will be changed very frequently in the future as more and more people are uh, just try uh, just to wear comfortable things rather than fashion fashionable things because in nearby future people used to just live in a comfortable space and need more plenty of time to spend their time with their parents and children and uh, so this is. Uh, All right. Thank you. This is the end of your practice speaking test. Thank you so much, ma'am.